All right, so it's before and after time. As you might know, I do before and afters with abs, butts, total body transformations, fat loss. Okay, my water's boiling, hold on. <laughs> So, making some boiling water. So, let's get right into it. Yesterday I was at the International Beauty Show, which is IBS. IBS is on all the flyers. I don't know who named this or who likes to have IBS on everything, but to me, it's kind of funny because working with clients on their health since 2009, IBS is a common thing that we talk about. I don't know. It's just funny. International Beauty Show. Maybe we should change the name. So I got these, finally, this has been around Super Smile, has been around for a long time. I got the Whitening Accelerator. This is not a paid post, I don't work with Super Smile, but I want to do the experiment. So I probably won't use the Whitening Accelerator until I get older, I just don't really want to use a lot of whitening products, because it is true that the more whitening products you use, depending on how they work, they can make your teeth more porous, so they can actually start to get more yellow and gray discolored over time when we use more whitening. So I actually am not sure if this whitening accelerator is going to make your teeth more porous, but I'm probably going to hold off on using this for a few years. So let's hope that nobody steals this from me and I'll be using this later. But what I will use is a whitening toothpaste. We have the coconut key lime mint and mandarin mint. I like fruity stuff. So I think it's like good for my mood, the more fruity stuff and colors around. It's very mood boosting. It's a lot more mood boosting than just like gray and black. So I'll be using these. I have not used whitening toothpaste. Probably only use them a couple times a year in the last five years. I've used white strips maybe three times in the last five years. So I'm going to use this whitening toothpaste for, let's give it four weeks. I didn't script this video and I didn't come up with the experiment before I started recording. Maybe I should have done that. So let's see, it's March 13th. I'm going to use these strictly, a few more other things I'm going to use, I like to bounce around, until April 13th and we'll do a before and after. So before, I got this yesterday, we have one, I think I'm whiter, I'm actually whiter than the whitest on here. So we got one on the grayscale and one on the yellow scale. Uh, maybe this we can use for somebody else. It doesn't really apply to me, but it does look very professional and makes it look like I'm doing an experiment, but this isn't going to work. So, here we go. Take a look. We got, this is more yellow. I care. I actually haven't brushed my teeth today yet because I want to wait for this, and it's, it's late. I also woke up really late. So, you got this? Uh, 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 I need to get a manicure. All right, got it, good luck. And we have to make sure this is a sort of controlled experiment, even though this is not professional, it's in a lab. We're gonna use the same light, so we're gonna use the same lighting the whole time. And uh, let's come back in a month and I'll see what happens. <laughs> 